Good day. The state television company of Western Armenia presents all the most important events of these days. Today's broadcast. The restoration of the Armenian church in Tigranagert of Western Armenia has been completed. Restoration works are planned in all churches of Artsakh. Statement by Artsakh State Minister Artak Beglarian. The governor Sunik met with the Iranian ambassador. Popularization of carpet weaving in Akhal Kalak under the NPART 2 project. Let's get acquainted with the provinces of Western Armenia, Daranagi. Medieval culture in Western Armenia. Let's support the state television company of Western Armenia. The Armenian churches of St. Kirakos and Mar Petun churches in Tigranagert of Western Armenia, which were damaged as a result of terrorist attacks in 2015, were restored at the expense of the Minister of Environment and Urban Development. Work on the restoration of the Armenian Church of St. Kirakos began in 2019. The church will be reopened on May 7th and blessing ceremony will take place on May 8th. The State Minister of Republic of Artsakh stated, Artsakh can never be part of Azerbaijan. We are all ready for any challenges, but we will never deviate from the path we have chosen. No one can afford it, and among Armenians who hold the different opinions, they are simply obliged to respect the will and right of the Armenians of Artsakh to decide their fate in their homeland. The right of indigenous people of Artsakh to self-determination prevails over all other norms of international law and geopolitical interest, and the principle of territorial integrity of Azerbaijan has nothing to do with the right to self-determination, which by the way is also accepted by the well-known Madrid principles approved by the mission of OSCE Minsk Group. To this is also added the principle of impossibility of living as part of Azerbaijan in the conditions of the consequences of the genocidal policy and further threats, which the international community must also recognize unconditionally, as it was for example in the case of Kosovo. There are no plans to build a new church in Artsakh in near future, but restoration work is planned in the old churches. The primate of Artsakh Diocese of the Armenian Orthodox Church, Bishop Vertanes Abrahamian, said this at thematic press conference. The construction of Amaras Monastery Complex is ready at a third stage. This is in 2023. All the construction work of the church will be completed, Bishop Vertanes Abrahamian said. According to him, in the near future, they will visit the monastery of Briyehti in the community of Hatio Mart in the region of Artsakh to organize the cleanliness of sanctuary and the surrounding areas. We will also carry out cleaning at the Yeritzmangans monastery, located in the village of Mutsmana Shogakavang in the Martagert region. At the same time, we are organizing a pilgrimage. We have already done similar work on the territory of Hakopavang in the monastery of Yerushe in Chartal, Bishop Vertanes Abrahman noted. Sunni Governor Robert Lukasian hosted Ambassador of Iran to Armenia, Abbas Badakhshan Zoguri. The main topic of the meeting was the opening of Iranian consulate in Kapan. During the meeting, the ambassador in particular said, the purpose of opening a consulate in the Sunni region is to develop relations in various fields. We attach great importance to the construction of North-South Road. Although there are countries that do not want the North-South corridor to pass through Armenia, this is important for Iran. International borders must be respected. There have been many developments in the Caucasus, especially in connection with your region, in connection with which Iran has clearly expressed its position. We are against corridor logic and defend the territorial integrity of Armenia. The sites also talk about a number of areas of cooperation of a new level expected after the opening of the consulate, discussing economic, educational, culture and other issues. Akhul Kalak Educational Center for Adults, within the framework of N Part 2 program, Program of Agriculture and Rural Development of the European Neighborhood, implemented the project Preservation of Culture Heritage of Sam Tsche Javak. The project was social and the goal was to develop tourism and restore Sam Tsche Javak. The director of the Adult Educational Center, Shorena Tetvadze, said, Carpet weaving is not so widespread in society, but as a cultural heritage, we wanted to popularize it. The number of of those willing to study unfortunately was small. Now there are about 10 and 15 people who want to study there. Daranag is a province in Western Armenia in the area of the middle course of Euphrates. In the center of ancient Armenian religion, the temples in Daranag has extensive estates, which after the proclamation of Christianity as the state religion in Armenia passed to the church, the main temple of the god Daramas and the tomb of the Armenian Arshakuni were found in the fortress of Ani in Daranag. Later, the territory of Daranag was named Kamakh. 
the capture of the eastern provinces of Iran and Byzantium by the Arabs in the middle of the 7th century had a significant impact on the political status of Western Armenia. During this period, the culture of Armenia began to flourish and the socio-economic situation clearly improved. Armenia in a stubborn struggle was able not only to preserve its socio-economic and national culture identity, but also to restore state and political independence laid by the Bagratuni dynasty. The rule of the Bagratuni established on the loyal throne on Armenia lasted for more than a century and a half. The high level of social, economic and cultural development of the Armenians of this period is evidenced by the architectural monuments of Ani and Dachtamar, the poem of Grigor Naregatsi, the Mook of Mournful Hymns, Numerous achievements of Armenian historiography. The state television company of Western Armenia remaining true to its principles and the viewers continues in interrupted work and new approaches. As you already know, our television broadcast mainly political and other news concerning the history, present and future of Western Armenia, as well as news raising various issues. We also present the events of President, the Government and National Assembly of the Structures of Western Armenia in a transparent and accessible manner. Dear compatriots, with your support, the possibilities of our television will expand and strengthen even more. Together we can do more. Now musical part Armenian folk dances, Kalashian sisters. The full version of this video is available on Western Armenia's YouTube channel. This was all for today. Goodbye.